proof of work let us consider a blockchain miner node this node is responsible for validating and adding blocks to the blockchain network the node will have a copy of the blockchain inside now consider a network of mining nodes with each node carrying a copy of the blockchain let us see what happens when a client sends a transaction to the network imagine the client c1 sending a transaction t1 to a network node the receiving node checks the validity of this transaction t1 and adds them to their memory pool in case the transaction is not valid the node simply drop the transaction it neither gets added to the memory pool nor broadcasted the valid transaction here the t1 however gets broadcasted by the node among its peers peers also check the transaction t1's validity and adds them to their corresponding memory pool peers further propagate the transaction t1 among their peers this process is repeated until all the nodes receive the transaction t1 meanwhile the nodes ignore the duplicate transactions that come besides now you see every node has received the transaction t1 what if there are multiple transactions happening simultaneously in a network Let's introduce a new client C2. C2 sends a different transaction T2 to the network. Very like before, the receiving node checks T2's validity and adds it to the memory pool. The same process gets repeated with T2. While T2 gets propagated through the network, another client C3 initiates a transaction called T3 to the network. Both T2 and T3 are now propagated. However, for many reasons, every transaction will not reach every node at the same time. Some nodes may receive all the transactions and some with few. Thus, based on the transactions received, each minor node now creates a block within them now the dilemma is which block should the network choose there are many different blocks in the network each block is different from another so how do we choose the block for this the network has to choose a leader the network will accept the block that the leader proposes let's see how it's done for that consider a block created by one of the minor nodes as you see a block has two parts a head and a body each with a couple of fields the head contains the block details for example when the block got created its root hash the hash of the previous block etc and the body contains different transactions that got carried in the network also There is a field called nouns which is a number that the blockchain miners are solving for. To start, miners initialize the nouns value to 0 and calculates the hash of the header. This hash is now compared with a target hash. A target hash will be a number that is public, specified in the protocol and recalculated at regular intervals by each node for example assume the target value is a number leading with these many zeros if the hash is higher than the target the value of nouns is incremented and hashed again because our aim is to find a hash below the target value this process repeats until a miner finds a hash value below the target this process is carried out by every node in the network until a solution is found now the miner have to compete with each other in calculating the hash of the block's header that falls below the target value 
The difficulty of the minor or the work to be done by the minor is trying quadrillions of times finding a noun that results in a low hash. Now we have a winner, a leader to elect the block. Winning node now adds a block that is created to its chain and broadcasts the same among its peers. Peers verify the new block, add the block to their chain and discard their created block. Also, transactions in the winning block are discarded from the memory pool of each node. Meanwhile, nodes ignore the duplicate blocks that come by. Eventually, the winning block will reach every node in the network. Now, the new block is added to the blockchain and the transactions T1 and T2 are considered complete. However, transactions not included in the winning block will be retained in the memory pool. Those transactions not included in the winning block will be considered for the next iteration and the process continues.